We got here on Saturday night because Kevin had a fever and we were worried that it could be COVID-19. Going back to the hospital this time, it's been nuts because now we have to wear this full gear, this little jumpsuit every time we go in and out. They actually tried to give me goggles today. The kids have been sick for over a week and unfortunately, we didn't have anywhere to put the girls one day. We had to take them to the hospital. We basically found out that he has this thing called the rhinovirus. It's kind of like the common cold, but then in Kevin's body, it's like the common cold on steroids. So here we are. It's been really bad, but um, the doctors say he's gonna be okay. His x-rays and CT scan all came back. His lungs are clear. I think what I've learned throughout this whole thing is that the smallest little cold can cause a huge, huge eruption in Kevin's body. And I don't know that it would even be strong enough to handle the coronavirus. So when I go home, I'm gonna clean out our entire room. I'm gonna sanitize everything. I mean, I literally have to put him in a bubble because there's really nothing else I can do. The doctor just came in and said, could you ask your village if maybe they could grocery shop for you, AKA neighbors. So um, I'm gonna do that because she said his immune system is basically gonna be suppressed for an entire year. So that's the latest. You wanna say anything else? That's it. Hello. Um, just gotta sanitize all the food. So, yeah, because we don't want any coronaviruses. We got some bread right here. Don't touch anything but this in your transport. We have a system. Would you like to videotape? Yes. Why does it smell like coffee? This goes oh, in the yeah, fridge. Oh, yeah, Oh, my God. Eggs. I'm holding mommy. Raspberries. <gasps> raspberries! Oh, yum! I love raspberries. Finish. Hey everybody, I'm finally home and I uh, just want to give you an update on how I'm doing. This has been a really tough last probably 10 days or so. I've been spending these last couple days in my own bed and trying to recover and trying to get my body moving again. It's been difficult actually just walking. Uh, I'm finding this uh, to be a lot longer road than maybe I had anticipated. Hoping these next couple of days I'll, I'll be able to get back on track a little bit better. Okay, you see this bike right here? I put this together all by myself. Okay, so check this little guy out. Look at him. He even has his own little resistance cords. All right, let's see how it goes. Bam. Yep. Sanitized the entire thing, unboxed and sanitized and put together by myself. What do you think? Do you like it? It's good, yeah. It's got a back on it and everything. Absolutely gorgeous outside this morning. Beautiful day, beautiful day. I'm not supposed to sit in the sun too long, but I love getting a little bit of sun at least. Oh, I got uh, some results back from my doctor yesterday. So I'm like shaking and I don't know the reason for why I'm shaking. I thought maybe it was just extreme fatigue and I needed to build up my uh, muscle tone again. But if we lower the dose of the tacrolimus, then I will not shake as much anymore, which would be really, really nice. So I'm sneaking up on the kids while they're doing homework and seeing how they're progressing. Hello. 
Well, hello there. Hello. How are you doing with your homework? Good. Doing what are you up to now? CGI problem. Doing it. Good, good, good. And then I did some yesterday, and we did some. Looking like you're doing a good job then. And then Keep I it up. Type paragraph, but I'm going to do CGI problems first. Okay, cool. I'll leave you to it. Okay. See ya. See ya. Bye. Bye. How are you doing? Good. I finished all my homework, so I'm oh, playing okay, good. video games. Uh huh. And Ava, what are you doing? My homework. What is your homework? What are you supposed to be doing right now? I'm writing a paragraph about Nikola Tesla. It looks like a lot. Yeah. Of writing. That's pretty awesome. Mm hmm So what are you guys doing in here? We're playing some games. Mom and Dad playing some too. And Daddy's looking up recipes. So Leah is either sick with a cold. I don't know how she would have gotten a cold or allergies, but we're not taking any chances, so... These two are keeping Kevin company. Kevin's looking up recipes. So here are some really cute, quick improvements we did to make this room a little bit more hospital-like-ish. That is like the best thing in the Ava world. Ava and Chase put this together for us today. This is our I'll pillow holder. This right here. I put together this exercise bike, which folds up actually even smaller. We could put it in the corner. We got our air purifier here. So then over here, we have our humidifier going that actually also does essential oils. Hey Chase, real quick, come demonstrate this. And then you gotta press Whoa. it again to turn off. But how did you do that? Let's go see what Leah's doing. Oh, is that what you're doing? Yeah, I think this one's better than this one. I mean, this one's better than this one. So I'm trying to make this one as good. I mean, I don't know how you could possibly be sick when sick. you've been around nobody. That's the thing that, like, I'm boggles my sick. mind. I have this little thing for my nose. Yep. And you're taking some vitamin C, yes. just in case. And you're taking Zycam. Yes, I do. I can't believe you're sneezing. All right, I'm out of here because I don't want to get Bye. what you got. Bye.